going guys and uh so today i did a thing and um wanted to do a little bit of a comparison video and uh so i, I already had um the xbox series x x controller which i got uh a few weeks ago and it's a great controller you know it it it, it, it is i mean it is a pretty good controller but today i went and picked up a ps5 controller and i wanted to do a little bit of a comparison video you know ps5 versus the xbox series x controller which one is better uh which one feels better and uh so let's do that today i haven't even opened this one yet yet i literally just picked it up so let's go ahead and do that all right so now i've got it open and uh man i'm not gonna lie this controller is pretty dope. Um, I've had a little bit of time. Um, like I said, I got this one um, about two or three weeks ago. And yeah, it's the white one. You guys can check that out. I believe it's the Arctic White is what they call it. And of course, I don't have a Series X yet or a PS5. Um, of course, if you've watched my other videos, uh, for Christmas I got my daughter um, a Series X. So she's got the black one. But I came across this, this white one, um, and I got it for a really good price. It was brand new, and I found it on Marketplace, and the guy was selling it. It was brand new. Um, I, I didn't ask any questions. He had like 25 bucks on it or something like that, and uh, it was kind of nasty out that day. I think it was like had been raining with a bunch of sleet and stuff. Anyways, long story short, he told me, uh, hey, if you meet up at my house, I'll give it to you for 20 bucks. I was like, 20 bucks for a brand new Series X controller? Nothing wrong with it, brand new in the box and everything. So I jumped on that and went and grabbed it. So I've had a little bit of time um, to actually, you know, mess around with it, compare it to the Xbox One controller. And I'm not gonna lie, you know, it feels great. Um, of course, you know, it's, it's really close to the Xbox One controller. Um, it, it does feel slightly, but now I've got big hands. So when, when they said that they, they, they made it slightly in just a little bit more, I was kind of worried that, you know, I was like, okay, well, am I not gonna, am I not gonna like it as much as I, I've always loved the Xbox One controllers because I'm not gonna lie, the Xbox One controllers, and even the 360 controllers were like my favorite controllers. They just always felt so great. Um, but, you know, to compare it a little bit, the D-pad is just absolutely amazing now. Um, it, it was never really an issue before, and I was I, I was kind of worried when I first got it. I was like, man, is this gonna be, is it gonna feel as good? And it, it does, I love that clicky, the clickiness, I, I, I love it. And then of course it's got the share button, um, the triggers was is slightly different now as well but uh yeah it feels really good it, it, it's a great controller you know Xbox went the route of if it's not broke don't fix it and maybe that was a you know, a little bit of a setback maybe they sh they, they should have changed it a bit but in my opinion I, I don't mind it um like I said they added the they changed the D button they added the the share button it's right there if you guys can see that and uh it's a good, it's a great controller. It, it's, it's, it's still, it's going to go down as a great controller. Um, in my opinion, at least. So really awesome. But let me put that down for a second. Um, but the PS5 controller, man, like I said, this is my first time I'm actually able to hold it. Um, I've seen them, I've seen them on the stores in a box or whatever, man. But for those, I'm sure you guys have seen it by now, but it, it, it feels good. Um, I was never a fan of, you know, of course I grew up um, with the PS1 and the PS2 controller and, you know, always kind of liked those. But then as soon as the Xbox stuff came around and started coming out, you know, obviously it was the way better controller, at least in my opinion, it was, it always just felt better. And I, I hated the, the, um, the joysticks, how they were, you know, right on with each other instead of like the traditional Xbox controllers where it was here and a lot of other companies and, and like uh, have modeled after this and I've always preferred that. Um, I hated, I'm not a fan of the PS3 controller 
and I'm not a fan of the PS4 controller at all. They feel really tiny. Like I said, I've got big hands. Um, I've already hated those controllers. Never was a fan of those. Um, so I was wondering, you know, am I going to really like this? And it's a way, way bigger controller. Way bigger controller. Um, and I was going to say, man, I wish Sony would have, you know, put put the joystick up here. You know, that would have been, even now with it in my hand, I still wish they would have done that and put the D-pad here, uh, perhaps. But with that being said, it actually feels good. Like, it, it feels great. Um, so I'm really excited to when I finally get a PS5 to actually dig in and, and get into this controller and see exactly how I'm liking it. Um, you know, how, how it feels. But for right now, it absolutely feels amazing. Like, it feels really good. Um, the buttons, everything feels good. Sony went really in on this controller. And, you know, that was the difference between the PS5 controller and the new Xbox Series X controller. This is a huge change from what we're used to. Um, if they would have had black, I know that that's not a thing yet. I would have gotten that instead. Um, and and it's eventually we will have different colors and I, I will eventually pick one of those up as well. But I'm really digging this, man. Like, it feels absolutely great. And of course, you know, the the the... the the options or the the features on this controller you know you got the microphone which you know the microphone sits right here um and then you've got the uh the what the hefty feedback and then what was the other uh the adaptive triggers so and of course we already know what those are you know when you're playing certain especially like shooting games or something like that if the game has that option of course you know the more you push it down so that's a really cool thing the thing is how many games are actually going to use that feature and i wish i wish xbox would have went that route as well and we probably will get in my opinion probably will get a pro xbox controller or whatever with that so that would be really awesome if xbox uh included that um now i know that there has been some reports on the, these controllers um some of them have been having issues especially depending on how rough you're with it i guess and what game you're playing where some of these triggers are actually breaking so I don't know. I guess we'll, we'll find out when I get there. But I don't know, man. This is a really nice controller. I was wanting, uh, because I'm such a fan of this controller, the Xbox controller, um, I was really wanting to kind of hate this, you know what I mean? And be like, no, nah, it's still the Xbox controller. Um, I don't know. I do like, I know you guys aren't probably going to see it, but the roughness of this, the grip, I do like this, and it, the PlayStation 5 controller, it, it does have that effect to it a little bit, not as much, so it is a bit, a little bit more slipper, slipperier than, than the Xbox controller. When I grab this, I feel like, okay, this is not going anywhere. This is in my hand. Um, when I'm grabbing this, even though it's there, it's not, it's still a, a tiny bit slick, but it's made perfect for my hand. It, it, I mean, it, it literally feels great. So I don't know which one I would say, you know, is the better controller. Um, this is great. And you could, you see the comparison, you could see them right next to each other. It's not like this one's super big or this one's super big. I mean, they, they, they both really feel great. Um, in my honest opinion. So oh, I actually turned it on by pushing the button. So I get like, of course, and it turned off cause there's no, console to hook it up to um yeah i don't know man i really do like it it feels great it, it really does feel great and I, lo I love the uh little features that they added to it so i can't really I, I really can't wait to to jump into this and give it a try on on an actual game so i'm really excited about that but i don't know have you guys tried it out if you have you know let me know in the feed uh, down in the comments you know it, which one you prefer better or if you've even had an opportunity to hold them both and what you guys think I, I'm a little bit torn right now and I, I didn't expect that I did not expect to be torn I figured that you know once I held it in my hand I was like okay it's got some cool features but I was still expecting to love the Xbox controller over it and I don't know man I'm, I'm, I'm a bit torn here I, I, I guess once I've actually played with these a little bit more 
or or will actually when I get to play with them, I'll, I'll have a little bit more of uh, an opinion and feedback on which one I like better. But as of right now, the way that they feel in my hands, I'm kind of torn, guys. Um, get a little bit closer, and they look great. It looks great. I, you know, I know it's a white controller. Both of them are actually, and you know, that's probably going to be a little bit easier to get dirty. Um, even though I'm super clean, but you know, it, it happens. But man, it does feel really good for all those uh, PS5 fans or Xbox fans, whichever one you're more of a fan of. This is a great controller, man. It feels super dope, super dope. Um, and like I said, I've always I've hated the last you know PS3 and PS4 controllers. Absolutely hated them. Um, it was always Xbox, always Xbox. But yeah. Anyways, guys. I hope you like the video. I hope you like my review on them. Um, and if you like the video, make sure you please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, if you could do that too, that'd be awesome. If you didn't like the video, give it a thumbs down. Um, definitely leave in the comments on uh, what you guys think and which one you prefer. You guys have a great one.